This document is level 2 4490 classified. Item number SCP 4490. Object class Neutralized. Special Containment Procedures SCP 4490 is stored in a secure item locker at Site 19. Once per calendar year, SCP 4490 is to be tested for functionality by a person with a visual acuity score of 2200 or worse. SCP-4490 may be reclassified as safe if found to be functional. Description SCP-4490 is a pair of corrective lenses that adapt their prescriptions to accommodate the wearer. Subjects with any sort of visual impairment will experience complete relief from their symptoms while wearing SCP-4490. Such impairments include but are not limited to astigmatism, macular degeneration, color blindness, and total blindness. Exposure to SCP-4490 does not permanently repair, restore, or correct visual impairment in exposed subjects, and all related benefits end when the glasses are removed. Recovery Log On December 12, 2016, researcher Samuel Hendricks was injured in an on-the-job accident where exposure to caustic chemicals caused irreversible blindness. Dr. Hendricks was granted early access to his pension and allowed to medically retire from his contract in good standing. On January 4th, 2020, Dr. Hendricks contacted the Foundation and requested to be reinstated. He disclosed that he had received an anomalous object that had restored the use of his vision. He offered to submit both the object and himself for any required testing, with the understanding his reinstatement would be given serious consideration. It is noted that Dr. Hendricks cooperated with all requests for information and access to the anomalous object in a timely manner. After careful evaluation, Dr. Hendricks was reinstated to active duty and allowed the use of SCP-4490 while assigned to Level 2 work. This employment agreement requires Dr. Hendricks to bequeath SCP-4490 to the Foundation upon either his termination, retirement, or death. SCP-4490, its carrying case, and an attached letter were all inventoried prior to Dr. Hendricks' return date. The carrying case is made from a dark stained hardwood and lined with a faux velvet material, and demonstrates no anomalous properties. A copy of the accompanying letter has been transcribed. Sam, all throughout my childhood, you were always the strong one, the leader. The house was always noisy, crowded, busy, but you were the calm and cool center of the storm for us all. I can't imagine any tougher task than trying to keep all eight of us in line after Dad died, but you found a way to get all of us out of high school alive. I just wish you could have done so with more compassion. Yes, Christmas is about rewarding each other with thoughtful gifts and the spirit of togetherness, but it is also about hindsight. You were cold, you were angry, and you were distant. It was one thing to want my oldest brother's respect, but entirely another when life cruelly bent our family into making that same brother into my father figure. But the lessons you taught me, some more poignantly than others, helped shape me into the man I am today. I'm an ophthalmologist, an actual honest-to-God doctor, and I've got the student loans to prove it. You forced me to grow up, to take responsibility for myself, to decide that if anything was going to be made of me, it had to start from within. For that, I thank you. And it is in the spirit of that hindsight I give you my greatest work to date. I was sorry to hear about your accident, and I can only imagine what you're going through. We both said some things, some really nasty things, to each other over the years. I hope you'll let me be there for you during this difficult time like you were there for me. And maybe this will make us cool again. 2020 Vision Your Little Brother James. Update. On January 6, 2021, Dr. Hendricks has applied for medical retirement once again. Further information was requested and he clarified that, as of January 1, 2021, SCP-4490 is no longer functioning.